Hello everybody, this is just a quick little video to show you something I've been working on and you let me know what you think and should I make some more I, uh, concepts, let me know some ideas. So I said I would change the stickers from the side of it, so what do you think? This is just trying to play in that style of what the uh, the new animation is, which is honestly <laughs> really hard to adapt I, or adopt. There's a lot of like scratches and things like that and a lot of different colors brought into it, but that's option one. And then option two that I have right now is just kind of going a little bit more classic, like old school Playmate stuff with the old van. This is just like solid colors, nothing crazy. I kind of cut my corner poorly here, but these are concepts, okay? So the, the real ones would be better with the black border and stuff. So yeah, I, those are the two concepts. And I do have a third concept, which is back to the other side. This one here with the, uh, the villain in the, he's all tied up because he's been captured. So what do we think? Is this a better option having this with a character in there? I know I didn't really care for the Michelangelo version on the other side, but that's because you have the figure and in, in, in this villain, they didn't make a figure yet. I think it's just a, I think this is the true villain of the movie we just haven't seen yet. Yeah, so just a, just a couple quick concepts, a couple sketches, you know, I could probably flesh out a little bit more, but you let me know, is this something you think you'd be into? And then beyond that, I have also, if you aren't familiar with the arcades that I've done in the past uh, and I sold out of, I, I had a bunch of different ones. Kind of teased last time was this Tempestuous Revenge, which I, I did sell out of, but this is an example of you know, kind of concepting these things from the Turtles show. But I worked with my friend Atomic Fox over on Twitter, and we now have a brand new thing to present to you. And this is just the very first concept of this. OK, there are definitely going to be some other games. That's no big deal. we got Terminator top, bottom sides. But oh boy, now we have an arcade style shooter. Check that out. So Atomic Fox is 3D printing these. He actually sculpted these things himself. The whole base, this whole section, right? So not only did we do the guns, with these things, you're able to remove the whole console with the joysticks and stuff, which made for a perfect opportunity to add these, this whole base. Look at this thing. He, he crushed it. He absolutely crushed it. This thing slides right into that spot. You get the two guns and I've, Again, this is a concept, so we're trying to figure out all the dimensions and everything like that. So I got to make these uh, holes for the guns a little bit bigger because it's all one piece. But this is essentially what you would be getting, but a little bit cleaner. So what do you think? Is this something you'd be, in, you'd be into? Is this not now the best arcade that I've come up with? I hope so, because all the other ones just have joysticks. This one, God, I... I, I, I'm, I'm such a fan of it. So I hope that you are too. You let me know if this is something you would buy or what arcade shooter you think needs to exist on an arcade. Things of homework from you, if you would be so kind. One, uh, alternative images for the van. What would you like to see? What styles or uh, visuals or something? And then two, what arcades do you want that are a shooter? I, I have two others that I've made and I think you'll really enjoy those too, but I haven't put them onto uh, one of these cabinets yet. So there's the other style without the villain in it, the very obvious villain that goes around and shoots Ninja Turtles with pizzas. It's just like, yeah, clearly the villain. This cool, I guess. I don't know. You let me know. Thank you so much for watching. We'll see you next time.